<laughs> Look at the Christmas tree! No way, that's so cool. Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. We are in KL today. It is our first Christmas in Malaysia. We are so excited to see what Malaysia has to offer at Christmas. We are here at the brand new Exchange TRX Mall where we're gonna start our day and then we're gonna spend the rest of the day in KL to see what Christmas is like in Malaysia. So we're doing it to try and get in the Christmas spirit a little bit. It's a couple of weeks until we actually head home to the UK to spend Christmas with our friends and family. We're not feeling the most festive, even though it's snowing right now. It's really not, obviously. It's Malaysia, it never snows. But we've decided to try and get in the Christmas spirit a bit before we head back home. Well, this is swanky. Yeah. I think we kind of knew it would be though, because this has yeah. been quite like longly anticipated, hasn't it? Yeah, and it's been hyped up quite a lot. Oh my goodness, there's a giant teddy bear inside of it. And it's swamped by children. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's baubles inside it. That's very cool. Oh wow, it's very like brand heavy, I'm noticing straight away. Yeah. We've got like Gucci, Fendi, Old Chanel. I guess because it's such a brand new mall, maybe it is. Maybe we won't be getting any Christmas shopping here. <laughs> yeah, we're like, let's get a bit of shopping done in time for Christmas. I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> I think a lot of malls, I feel like they have all the big brands when you first walk in. And then, yeah, on the upper floor. Yeah, like somewhere a bit further the away. Cheapy, cheapy stuff. Where's the Primark? <laughs> Look at the Christmas trees! There was a massive one outside. Did you actually film yeah, it? Yeah, I think. Oh, I don't know if I did. We were taking I a photo in front of it. So if not, we'll insert it. But look at this oh, from Chanel. Chanel. Oh, look, they've got a massive Chanel bottle. Oh, my word. That is oh, crazy. Oh, wow. Look all the way up there as well. Oh, look at the line. It says, mind my step. I don't really want to step on it. I feel like I don't belong here. Yeah. <laughs> I definitely don't, but I'll... I was going to say, Emma's just strutting on there, you know. I mean, I've never bought it. anything from Chanel in my life. Oh, not for Chanel set. I can't believe they've commissioned two massive sets. Look at this dude. What on earth is this? I'm so confused right now. Jake has gone to the toilet. They aren't real, are they? No. Oh my goodness, where is Jacob when I need him? I mean, that's a good way to get people in your shop, I guess. It's obviously like animatronics or whatever you call it. But I'm so confused because a little bit of me is like, no, this is real. I'm sure it looks so, it looks too real to not be real. So weird. I cannot wait for Jacob to see these. I know what I'm looking for. <laughs> Just oh, wait. Oh, no way, that's so cool. That's so mad, they actually look real. I know. I spent ages going, are they real? even blinky. I know, they, their tail moves, their head moves, their mouths move. It's chewing. It literally looks like it's looking at that kid. Yeah. So clever, isn't it? I just don't see the need for it. I... Well, it's getting everyone in the shop, isn't it? I guess, yeah. There must be something going on. Maybe it's like a celebrity. Oh, it's this store opening promo, so it must be like the first day it's open. Ah. Thank you. It's a chicken. Chicken. It's chicken. Oh. And what's this? Is this? Uh, this one is tuna. 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 Okay. Yeah, yeah. And beef. Ah, oh, beef as well. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, skewer. Oh yeah, that's really nice. It's really tender. We just come up a few floors to see if we could find some cheaper items, and there's this massive staircase. It's so extra. I feel like we're on the ground floor, even though we're on the top of the building. It looks like there's a garden over there. Nice though, they've created a mall, but then they've also created like an outside space. Oh, there's a whole play park up here as well. It's crazy. Look at this guy. Oh, 
chunky cookies. Oh, chunky. What they better word. be chunky. <laughs> what a word. I love a cookie. Are we going for one? Well, let's see how chunky. Oh, they are chunky. All right, they are some chunkers. Oh, look at that selection. Dark chocolate chunks. All right, let's get that chunker. Oh, I'm so excited. Can I just say, Jake never lets me get things like this. So yeah. He's only done this because Because it's a special, special one. Day. Oh, look at that marshmallow. We. Oh, man. Is it good? It's pure sugar. I was going to say, it looks so rich. Pure sugary goodness. It's like cookie dough. Oh. It's like, look at how soft it is. Yeah, that looks so nice. Mm. Oh my god, it's chunky. That's a heart attack waiting to happen, that cookie. It's just pure indulgence. A nice little Christmassy cookie to start us off. We don't normally splurge. We normally go for cheap things and we don't normally buy things in malls. But it's a special day. We're getting in the Christmassy spirit. It's December. And it's chunky. <laughs> it's chunky <laughs> time. <laughs> this is the view of me right now. I almost just dropped it. The cookie. Now I'm cradling it like my baby. <laughs> so we've just walked home from TRX and we are now at the Giant Times Square. So let's go and have a look and see what they've got. It's like a little Sancho workshop. Yeah, it's awesome. Oh, wow. This is so pretty. It's like a. Feel more festive yeah. than the last one. Really? It's really like I don't know, like traditional. And... Yeah. I think as well, as soon as you hear the Christmas music, it's like yeah. it's like all the warm lights and the, yeah. and the green. It's very traditionally Christmas rather yeah. than like modern Christmas. Oh, this is so cute. I really like it. Oh no, they got reindeer. It's like your dad's workshop, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. This is amazing. Oh, yeah, they've got like an old fashioned radio. Yeah. Titch fan. Workshop for the elves to make the toys. Oh, that's so cool. I feel like a child. Yeah, I do love that like people can just come in and just play around yeah, and. Like there's kids just playing. Yeah. Oh, wow. I didn't even notice that. This says Choc Boutique. This sounds like my kind of place. There's a sleigh. No. <laughs> Do you want a photo in the sleigh? Definitely. Such a child. Are you happy with yourself? I have to say, the decorations are better, but the reindeers aren't moving. They're not moving, no, but I feel like I am absolutely loving it. Yeah. This is so like getting me in the Christmas. It's so spirit. magical, isn't it? So we've just got our favourite egg custom tart, but this one has actually got black sesame in it. And it's from a place called Mickey Bakery. We've had these before and I haven't stopped thinking about them since basically. Yeah, they are glorious. Mm. It's so like soft and eggy. And the black sesame just gives it that something a little bit different, mm. a little bit extra. So this next one is actually, I think, a little bit of a hidden gem. We found this a few months ago and it's quite a unique one. It's not like a big one. I don't think people necessarily come here a lot. Yeah. But basically it's got lots of like thrift stores in it and lots of more like independent stores, I think. Mm. So it's just a bit different and we're just going to have a quick look and see what they've got going on in there and see if we can get any presents. I think this is actually one of the malls that my mum used to come up to a lot because I think back in the day when it was built, it was kind of like the biggest mall around there. It's Sango Wang Plaza. Decisions, decisions here. Now these are Jacob's decisions because donuts are his thing. Can I just get one of the, just one of the biscuits? 
We're not getting lunch today. We're literally just snacking all day. Oh, they do cheesy bites. They look really good. They remind me of Lisa's cheese straws. We could go for some of them right now. It's the first mall that we've seen which is doing actual Christmas music rather than kind of random covers, which is nice. Oh my word. Oh, look at the little mistletoe. I know, there's so much green and red. I like it. Is it like icing? Yeah. And then it's got biscoff and... Mm. Are they like bits of jelly? Like jelly sweets? Yeah, I don't know what they are, but they're nice. All right, do you want to tell everyone what you just did whilst eating this donut? I thought it was sugar paper. So Emma went to the little bit of paper here and went, Oh, do you want a bit of this? Went to bite it and just picked it up on the paper. And then had to spit it out. It was like really hard cardboard as well. Yeah. That was a shame, I was looking forward to that. So from Sun Go Wang, we've bought some Christmassy yeah. clothing. Yeah, Christmas get up. Emma's gone for the little antlers. I've got a Santa hat. We've got a Christmas party on Saturday. When we left home in April, we didn't really think about bringing Christmas clothing. Yeah. And then, yeah, we've been invited to this Christmas party, so we've had to just quickly improvise. But for a couple of quid. Yeah. Right. Sorted. So if anyone knows the geography of KOL, you'll know where we're heading next. So arguably one of KL's most famous malls, Pavilion. Pavilion Mall usually goes all out for their decorations each year. And it looks like they've done the same just from the outside. Oh, it's looking good. Yeah. yeah I'm excited for this one. It looks quite like old school, doesn't yeah. it, with the trees? Oh, wow. That's so nice, isn't it? Yeah. Goodness, look at that. Oh, That's look at the smile. Beautiful, isn't it? I feel like it's such a simple tree, but it's so good. Like, yeah. It looks so nice. It just looks beautiful. Yeah. I love the warm lights, and I love the mm. fact that they're so tiny. Yeah, they're, they're like really little stars. Oh, oh my days. Oh my word, look at that. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is so beautiful. That's so pretty, isn't it? It's like a Christmas tree made out of multiple Christmas trees. Are you crying? <laughs> oh, it just looks so pretty. Are you alright? This makes you feel Christmassy, doesn't it? That they've got a little merry-go-round there. I know you'd said it was going to be amazing, but I don't think I'd quite like prepared myself for yeah. how amazing it was going to be. But because we've seen so many others today, I think I thought we were kind of like, oh yeah, we've seen it all now. Yeah. This is just like on another level. I know. It wouldn't be Christmas without a little Christmas coffee, wouldn't it? So what are we gone for? Cinnamon. I cinnamon latte. I cinnamon <laughs> This looks very good indeed. I think it's got cinnamon on the top, like sprinkles. Cin cinnamon sugar. So we were at Jayco Donut. Oh, it's very strong. Is it? But it's got, you can really taste the cinnamon. It's like the cinnamon's like a really nice like aftertaste. Oh, it's very Christmassy. It's very like, gives you all the Christmas feels. It would have been good to have it hot. It is very strong, isn't it? But it's just too warm to have a hot say, coffee in right now. It's far too hot, isn't it? Maybe when we get back to England. Oh, that's good. I like it. Okay, so I've just stirred it a little bit more and it now tastes even better. Yeah. It basically tastes like a hot cross bun in a drink. Hot cross bun isn't really Christmassy though, is it? It's more Easter. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like that really like Christmassy hot, hot cross bun. bun. It's very good though. He is very cute. Oh, can we eat him? 
No. 880, are you joking? That's so much for a gingerbread man, no. Yeah, but he's really chunky and he's like... No. No. What about the Christmas tree? No. Why actually not getting one? No. Yeah, but not for 880, I don't love it. So we've just arrived at our last mall of the day and we are at Surya KLCC. Looking forward to seeing what's in here and then hopefully going to see the towers afterwards. Look at the Grinch mugs. Look at this one, Zell. Oh yeah. They're so cool. We're so simple. <laughs> oh wow, there's a massive clock. It's like a gingerbread clock. Yeah. Oh yeah, there's gingerbread on the top. Yeah. Oh, look at the little rose. Oh, they're like cobblestone. Oh, there's a gingerbread pie. Oh, look at the chocolate fountain. Is it real? No. Oh. <laughs> I feel like this is definitely up there with one of the better ones. I mean, it would definitely be improved if the chocolate fountain was yeah. Then I might even put it at number one. If that was a real shot for the fountain, I'd be in there. Claim it. So we're just coming out to the back of KLCC where the park is. You can just see the bottom of the tree. I know. Oh, little gingerbread Santa. Oh my goodness, how big is this thing? <laughs> <laughs> That's so crazy. Whoa. Oh my word. That might be the biggest Christmas tree I've ever seen. Yeah, I think I so. Like this is the sort of thing you'd have in like New York or something. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'd love to see it at night. It's such a shame. We've got to get back because yeah. Jacob's got hockey. Let down. Sold. I bet it looks that so That must look amazing at night. At night. Maybe we'll have to try and come back at some point. It's the tallest Christmas tree in Malaysia. Ah, oh, okay. It's 32 meters tall, that is mental. Oh, and then look at the Petronas Towers behind it. Well, what a day this has been. Yeah. Definitely feel more Christmassy. Oh my goodness. Our aim was to get a bit more in the Christmas spirit because we found it difficult this year and my goodness we've definitely done it i wasn't convinced it was going to work but i feel so christmasy now i definitely feel like i am ready to have christmas dinner eat all the mince pies drink a whole lot of eggnog <laughs> yeah which was your favorite if we're talking about decorations alone i think it's got to be bajai times square i just love that you could go in you could play around with all the stuff like it was really immersive and you could just kind of get involved. I feel like BTS really kind of made me feel like a proper like traditional old school Christmas vibes. But for me, I feel like Pavilion topped it. It was yeah. always going to. My reaction kind of said it all. Yeah, I mean, she's basically crying. I literally like welled up as soon as I saw it. Yeah, I think it was because I didn't think I was going to be, it was going to really make me feel that Christmassy. But as soon as I saw that. Yeah, you couldn't help but feel it, could you? I think another reason that I got a bit emotional is because I sort of thought, oh, I'd love for all my like friends and family to see yeah. this. And, I was, and it just sort of like hit me like, yeah. how lovely it would be to share this with all of our friends and family so I yeah. think that's another reason it made me feel a bit emotional. Malaysia knows how to do malls and it knows how to do malls really well. Well they know how to do malls at Christmas. It has been an amazing day so we're going to end this here. We are truly in the Christmas spirit now yeah. and we'll see you in the next one which is going to be another Christmassy one and another one that I am super excited about. If you're looking forward to the next video or if you want to see that don't forget to subscribe. That should hopefully be out in a week or so. Just in time for Christmas. All right. See you later. Merry See you. Christmas. See you soon. Bye.